a present from Santa. I'll get us out of it. It's not working. Jeremy, we've got a problem. I see it, Aelita. I'm already on it. you go? Look, I painted over it with blue. Now look at this awful color. Hiroki, I want you to go home right now, okay? Take Johnny with you and uh, I'll meet you there later. What? But what about Mrs. Hertz's class? Hiroki, you heard me! Hey, what's the matter with you? You got in a fight with Ulrich again, huh? By the way, Suzanne, how's it going with Pedro? Oh, really, Jim? Not around the students. Oh. Mrs. Hertz, we have to evacuate the academy. What are you talking about, Yumi? Well, it's a... I know this may sound crazy, but a meteorite is going to hit right here where we're standing. Hold on, Oishiyama. I told you eating that raw fish was no good for you. No, I swear it's true. I just found out from a, a friend who works at the National Observatory. Wow! <gasps> hey, look, did you see that? Oh, check it out. Great fireworks! Jim, we have to evacuate the academy. Huh? The firewall's energy is set up along a fairly basic algorithm. All we have to do is crack it, and we'll be able to slip through a breach in security. Good idea. Hey, I think I finally understand what Xan is really up to. Bravo, Einstein! You finally realize that he wants to destroy the supercomputer to keep us from coming in and pulling the virtual carpet out from under him? Well, obviously. But this time, he picked the most perfect moment. Of course. By destroying the supercomputer, Xana will not only destroy Lyoko, but more importantly, our only way back into the real world. But why would he want to trap us here? To get a hold of you, Aelita, you're the one Xana has wanted to capture since we recreated Lyoko. It's called killing two birds with one stone. Come now, Suzanne, this is ridiculous. Are you absolutely sure it couldn't have been from something else? Fireworks, for example? Mm -mm. That's what I keep telling her. But I think she overdid it with the mint tea. I know what I saw, Jean-Pierre. It was a meteor shower. We have to get the students to safety now. Hmm. Fine. As a precaution, I'm willing to go ahead and evacuate the academy, but I don't want any panic. <laughs> On the weak link in the algorithm. It's as plain as day. The system overcompensates pressure, but it takes three milliseconds to inverse its polarity. Of course. By synchronizing the initial pressure, you can neutralize the sinusoidal distortion, Aelita. Translation? Rubber band system. Hang on. Stand by for stopping the turbo prop. Ready? And now! <laughs> nice one, Aelita. Now hurry and get over to the hub. We need you back in Lyoko ASAP. Roger. Everyone okay? My breakfast wants to come back up to say hello, but otherwise, all's well.